Introducing the hand sensor switch. This unit has an actual beam that it shoots out at three degrees in front of it. So it's so narrow that your finger will not activate it if you're not right over on that beam. Being narrow, it's designed so you can have multiple switches next to each other so they will not interfere with each other. The unit right now is in its momentary mode. As you can see, it detects an object in front of it, but it will not detect things that are not in that three degree range. To change the mode from momentary to toggle on off, what we have to do is go to the back of the unit where we have uh, two potentiometers. This one adjusts the range from two to eight inches. Uh, this is a jumper for the LEDs you saw on the front, the red and green. Gives you the ability right now, we are set for internal relay control. So whatever the unit does, you can see it changing from green to red. Now, some people might want to be able to control those same LEDs externally. So all you do is put the jumper in here. It gives you the ability with the two wires here, individually control a red and a green LED externally. Now, this potentiometer adjusts the timing for your momentary from half a second pulse all the way up to 20. But if we want to go to toggle on off switch mode, all we do is we go all the way to the right. We are now in the toggle mode. In the toggle mode, the unit will turn on and off just like a switch. If you notice, I'm not touching the switch at any time, which means I cannot infect the switch and the switch can't pass a virus on to me. A couple of important notes. The unit itself is stainless steel body, so it's not gonna rust. The front of the unit is actually waterproof IP55. The unit works on 24 to 12 volts, so anything in between is fine. And it has a internal relay, one amp, single bolt, double throw. So it's got normally open and normally closed contacts if you need to use any of those.